hi guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome my name is jane and this is jane's biz i upload videos just like this including come shop with me videos and reviews as well so if this is the kind of video that you like to watch why not subscribe to my channel i have such a lovely community right here i would love for you to join the family and it also means that you will be helping my channel just by clicking the subscribe button and also click the notification bell so you'll be notified when i upload new videos because i upload videos almost every day of the week so there will be something for you to enjoy i want to say thank you in advance and i also want to thank you all my lovely subscribers you guys are amazing thank you for the support thank you for watching my videos thank you for all your lovely comments i really do appreciate you guys thank you so much so the first thing I want to show you is this Maxi Oval Cotton Pads I got from Wilco. They are 50p each, but I must confess, um, they have actually degraded the quality of these pads because the ones I used to get before were much, much thicker and, you know, they looked more nicer. They had a better package. Well, similar, but it's a different color. But the feel and the touch is a bit thinner than before and but nonetheless they're still okay i got loads when i went to the shop there because i had plans for it and i shared this on my instagram so so if you're not following me on instagram you need to follow me on instagram because i share a lot of things that you don't get to see on the video here on youtube so i'll just put a picture up i put a picture up of what i mean i wanted to fill up my jar and this is where I went. I went all out. I got about six, but I ended up filling the jar up with just three. And if you go onto my Instagram, you will know the whole story. But yeah, this is this is what I got them for. And I've always I've always liked buying my cotton pants from Wilco. Um, although these ones are not as good as the ones I used to get, but they're still okay. They're still okay. Now the next thing I'm showing you is this <laughs> is this jar again? I have shown I have shown this in a previous haul, but I just wanted to show you guys this again because I because uh, I went back again to get it because as as always they go out of stock very quickly and then they come back in stock again. So when you see them, it's just best to get it straight away. And these obviously are from Unbargains. So what I wanted to show you was that I got the ones with the white lead in the previous haul it was just the one with the pink lead yeah so that's just all i wanted to show you and you would have seen also in my instagram you need to follow me on instagram i share the picture of what everything looked like in my kitchen cabinets cupboards and yeah so go follow me on instagram so you can see it there now the next thing i've got here is also is this e-cloth i've been hearing so much about this e-cloth I've, I've seen it so many times at TK Maxx, I've never really bought into that idea, but I've heard a few YouTubers rave about it, and I thought, you know what, well, let me try it. As you can see at the back, it's got three-year guarantee, and it does say that you can wash it about 300 times at 90 degrees every week, and it will still last you for three years. Hmm, we'll see. <laughs> so I got the stainless steel one, um, and I got the bathroom one the stainless steel one looks it's just to me it's just a normal microfiber cloth however it is a bit thicker than your normal microfiber cloth and with the stainless steel one cloth it's got different size one side is for a polished polished steel and the other side is a, for non-polished steel i don't really know the difference if i'm being honest but as you can see one side has a it's a bit of a different te texture to it and the other side is just plain and it's just like a normal microfiber cloth and so far i've actually enjoyed using it i must say with the bathroom one it's re it has really saved me from using a lot of antibacterial wipes you know the the ones you throw away <laughs> so it's really saved me from using that because i tend to use them a lot because i like to just when i get into my toilet or bathroom something doesn't look right to be a dirt heels i just quickly clean so i just whip up my antibacterial wipes and i just clean the old thing straight away but with the cloth which i have there is just use the cloth to just wipe it clean and it, it drops down really and yeah that's one thing i'll say it's done for me which i enjoy so 
so i got this three pack of method surface cleaner from pascal so i got the anti-back one the multi multi-purpose one i guess and the bathroom one the only thing i have with method cleaners is that i find the smell very over very overpowering is that the word they're very they're very strong i think and for them to say it's not toxic and it's natural i feel like with the smell and how strong it is it feels like it could be but obviously they say it's not and i believe i want to believe that it's not so i got this for £4.49 at costco and if you were to get this anywhere else each one i actually have a video a clip from tesco where they sell each one just just a single one for three pounds so imagine what you how much you're saving i thought that was a bargain a very good bargain i talked about my organized kitchen cupboards this is the adhesive labels that i use for them and i got this also from Ruko. and actually initially when i started i had this self adhesive labels also from Ruko. but this was about 10 years ago we bought this and never used it but actually the new ones are much much stronger i feel like the, the adhesive part of it is much stronger than the old ones you would have seen it in my previous video i actually started with a chalkboard label but my writing is not very great <laughs> so i decided to just switch to a normal adhesive self labels that you can just print off your computer which which is a bit more nicer than my handwriting <laughs> There was a time where I always get my washing up liquid from Ruko because they, I like the bottles and they're just 50p each. But when I went there to this time, they didn't have the ones I normally get because because they had about three different scents. They had a pink one. I can't remember what it's called. They like a pink one, a yellow one, and a blue one. But when I went there, they only had this antibacterial one so i got that one instead and then i also found this easy one that says double bubbles i thought oh, okay let's see so another one i've got here is this Lenore crease releaser from Unbaggins. so everyone's raved about it so i had to jump on it so if you're someone like me that do not like to iron do not enjoy ironing then this is for you I also got the scent booster, the laundry scent booster as well. And something I did, which I sh also shared on my Instagram, was I put them in the in the little um, bags, and I just use them as like an air freshener around my home as well. This is a very popular hack that people do anyway. So I've been wanting to do that for a long time, so I got to do that, and I think it, it actually does work it does work so if you have not tried it definitely try it definitely try it and what and the funny thing i've got is fabulosa I mean, what else can i say and it's just one pound as well so this is where i'm gonna leave you guys i hope you've enjoyed this video again do not forget to subscribe leave a comment like and share this video click that notification bell so you'll be notified when i upload new videos and i want to thank you so much for watching and i will catch you guys in my next video Bye bye